Hi guys, so this is a video of some craft items that I found at this store that's in, in the city. I'm, I'm in New York. Um, and there's this store called Lot Less. I guess the equivalent of it is like a Big Lots, where they just have a variety of like house goods and clothes and different stuff. Closeout stuff, you know. And I've never really found craft stuff, although I have found baking stuff there because I've purchased like Wilton boxes and stuff like that. Um, and so I was there recently. I, I go there like on my lunch break because it's in the city. And I found a bunch of scrapbooking stuff for a really good price. So these are some stickers that I picked up. This is the first one by K and Company. Um, and it was 99 cents and it's just a bunch of sentiments. I thought that was really cute. So that was that. I thought that was cool. Whoops. My craft area is a mess. Um, and then I found these two Hampton Art sets. They're the same sets, but they're different colors. Um, it has basically a sheet of bling and then a couple of stickers with different sentiments on it. This is really cute, the little banner. So there's like happy birthday and just a few different ones. Sorry for the glare. So I got the blue set and then I got the same ones in pink. And these were 99 cents. They had green and they had red, I think. The green was like a mint green, like a spring green. And then the red was cute, it looked kind of Valentine-y. Um, so I picked up those. Then I got some more K and Company stickers. These are like the little dimensional stickers. So these were 99 cents as well. I thought that was cute with the little flowers and butterflies. This one is a poker theme. I love that little um, card hand. I thought that was cute. Oh, it's like a Vegas you get at the chapel. <laughs> and then there's like the little anniversary one. And this, oh, I got duplicates of this one. Oh, well, there's that one again. So those were 99 cents each. I thought that was great. And then I thought this, I couldn't believe it. I think if I could have carried more, I would have hauled everything they had in the store. So this is an EK Tools stamp and punch set. And it has a giant punch. I think if it says it, let's see. It's probably like a two inch punch. Um, but I guess it's closeout, right? Because they sell closeout stuff there. So it's this really pretty like starburst. And then... Down here are a bunch of stamps. Look how cool. And then on the back, there's even more stamps. That one says congratulations and thank you. And then they just have the little um, ideas on the back, like how to make rosettes or how to use it as a punch on a card. I thought that was really cool. For $3.99, I looked online and I think I saw this for $24.99. So for 4 bucks, you can't go wrong. So I actually... Ooh, I'm making a mess. I actually picked up a second one because I want to do a little giveaway. Um, and I'm working on some stuff, putting some stuff together. Um, because I'm at like 240 subbies, so I just want to do a small giveaway. But anyway, I also picked up this heart-shaped punch. And this looks like a 2-inch punch also. Um, same price, $3.99. And that's how the box looks. And then this is the stamps it came with. This one's really cool. It looks like a poker card as well. And that I guess this was a Valentine one, and there's the little project ideas that they give, and the rest of the stamps, which I think are really cool. So four bucks, you can't go wrong, and it, they're super heavy. Like I said, if I could have carried more, I probably, <laughs> I probably would have grabbed everything they had. Um, so I picked up these Jolie's Boutique's Easy Image. So these are inkjet transfers. They're basically like printer paper for inkjet printers. And then, um, so you print out your image and then you can like iron it onto fabric. And 99 cents, I thought that was pretty good for five sheets. So I picked up two of those. I don't have any project in mind for that, but I'm sure I'll think of something. And then if I could have carried everything they had, I'm, I'm telling you, I would have got all of these. I'm gonna go back, cause I got this yesterday on my lunch break. I'm going to go back Monday and see if I can, if there's anything left, I'm going to pick them up. But this is a die cuts with a view stack. 
and it's called DIY Project Stack Mini Albums. And I paid $2.99 for it. When I got back to my desk on my lunch break, I went on joannes.com. They actually still sell this stack for $20. Bucks. Um, I think right now, Joann's has like 50% off paper stacks, so it's $10. Bucks, but still, I mean, I paid $3 for this. So this says it makes three projects. It's basically like a DIY kit for a mini album, which I've never made a mini album, but I think that's really cool, right? And it comes with a template sheet, 28 double-sided cardstock sheets, six foiled sheets, 12 printed vellum, which I'm so excited about that, and a sticker sheet. So I picked up three because this was so heavy, guys, and I take the subway. I don't know if you guys are familiar with New York, but I take the subway home and I look like a mad woman with these two giant bags of stuff and the train was so crowded. And I don't know how I made it home, but I made it home. Um, so let me do a flip through. This is such a cool stack. I'm really, I, like I, I just saw it and I grabbed it. I, I wish I would have actually like really taken a really good close look because I probably would have grabbed them all and left half of them at work and then brought them home and, sh and like batches. But anyway, whatever. So the cover is an acetate sheet, which I'm gonna pull off and use, but let me see. Maybe I should snip this. Give me a second, guys. Let me snip this. Okay, guys, so I snipped the edges, and I just want to show you how it looks. <clears throat> so these are, like, the instructions on how to make the mini album. And then this is the sheet of stickers. I don't know if you can see that with my lighting, but they are the clear stickers with the white print. And there's, like, hearts and butterflies and um, different sentiments. And then this is the vellum. So there's two sheets of this pretty one with the little triangles, this really pretty red one, this kind of gold printed one with polka dots, and then, let's see, there's this really cool one with different cut aparts on it, like little banners and pieces, ah, little bows, and there's just some, because I guess it's mini album, right, so they're like a bunch of four by sixes, and then there's the sentiment ones, Hello there, I heart you. Um, this is the printed craft paper ones with the gold foil. Look how pretty, I don't know if I'm in frame, but look, this really pretty flowery one and this pretty arrow one. There's some polka dots and some more arrows. And then this is the double-sided cardstock, so these are the cut aparts. Really cool, I'm sorry, I don't have, um, and I'm trying to face the, the light so you guys can see it, but Wow, look, these are like little envelopes, oh, pockets. This is gonna be really cool for a flip book. And then there's some little page flags and things. Some more four by six squares, cut aparts. Polka dots and this beautiful flower print. So I picked up three of these and there was about six more. Look how pretty this polka dot one. Another beautiful flower print, this wood grain, more triangles, arrows, really cool. For $2.99, that's like, that was like the deal of the century to me. So I actually picked up three of these, so I think what I'm going to do is make this a little giveaway. Um, I'll give away this and the duplicate pack of K and Company stickers that I accidentally purchased two of and all you have to do this is just going to be a little flash giveaway so all you have to do is enter say enter me down below you must be a subby open to US only because this is going to be heavy to ship and I'm not sending this priority guys because it would only fit in like a box and that'll cost me 15 bucks that defeats the purpose of you know the mega haul or um so I think what I'll do is put this in like a manila envelope like some type of um yellow envelope packaging and try to send it either first class or, or parcel post so hopefully it'll be a little cheaper because this is pretty heavy but the width of it doesn't fit in like the padded envelope um that's only six or seven bucks to ship so yeah you must be a visible subby comment down below enter me and um it's not a requirement but i would love if you would share the video so that i can 
um, get a few more subbies. And today is Saturday the 27th, but it's late. So I don't know if this video will be up before Sunday. So tomorrow's Sunday the 28th. So let's say I'll have it open from Sunday the 28th to what? Monday's leap day? Or is Monday the 28th? I don't know. It'll be up until next Saturday, and I will put the dates in the description box. And, yeah, that's all you have to do is comment down below, enter me. And um, I just want to say thank you to everybody who subbed to me, and hopefully you can share this video and get me um, get some more views on this video. And, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.